All right, and welcome back to another episode of Mr. Felstrom's Precalc Cast. Today's benchmark, 11.1, .1, the sine, half angle, and double angle formulas. This benchmark is two parts. Uh, one is going to ask us to actually evaluate the sine of either a double angle or half angle, and the second part will just ask us to write the formula of the other one. Uh, and so here I have the formula for a double angle, which is what we are going to try to find, the sine of 2u. I do give you some information. Uh, I'm telling you that the secant of u is negative 5 halves, and we also know that u is in between pi over 2 and pi. What this is telling us is that u is in quadrant 2, which we need to know in order for uh, you know, positive and negative values for our, our trig functions. So I set up a reference triangle here, and I'm going to list uh, what I do know, secant uh, of u, and I'm calling this angle right here u prime, because it's not actual u, um, but a reference angle. Uh, the secant is negative 5 halves. Now, secant's uh, hypotenuse over the adjacent. So my adjacent is a negative 2, and the hypotenuse is 5, and uh, I'm going to use Pythagorean theorem to find the opposite sign. So negative 2 squared plus b squared will equal 5 squared. And 5, so it looks like b will equal the square root of 21. Okay, and so now uh, all we're going to do to find the sine of 2u, uh, we're going to use the uh, double angle formula. So the sine of 2u will equal 2 times the sine of u times the cosine of u. The sine of u is opposite over hypotenuse. So 2 square root 21 over 5 times cosine of u, which is the adjacent over hypotenuse, and that's going to be negative 2, 5. And the, and the reason why it's negative, uh, our angle is in quadrant 2 where cosine is negative, so that's representing the negative uh, sign, uh, sign there. So uh, simplifying that out, 2 times 2, you get negative 4 square root 21 over 25. And there is our final answer. Okay, uh, part two is write the formula uh, and interval for sine of u divided by 2. Formula first, so the sine of u divided by 2, the half angle formula is plus or minus the square root of. 1 minus cosine of u divided by 2. And the interval is going to be half of the interval that we were given. See, u is in between pi over 2 and pi. Well, if I cut this in half, all that in half, my interval becomes pi over 4. and pi over 2. What this actually does is limit our uh, angle instead of quadrant 2 now we become uh, quadrant 1. Uh, pi over 4 and pi over 2 that's all in quadrant 1. And since sine is positive we're gonna want the positive square root value. And that's how we would set it up if I had to find the half angle for this particular problem. And there you have it. So thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.